Hey guys, it's James Cutson here. Hope you guys are all safe and well. So welcome back to episode number 12 of Standing United. Remember to hit a thumbs up on the video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And also share it as well. So, just a quick shout out on PlayShare TV, or Dave Glynn, as you know him by. Um, he's currently still in hospital at this moment. So, get well soon, Dave. And hopefully you will be out watching the rest of the series. I know it's one of your favourites. But also, a couple of shout outs to two new subscribers who are joining my channel. Welcome to James Cutson. And also, in this episode, we are going to be playing three games. So first up, we're going to play Bradford, then we're going to play Hull, and then we're going to play Portsmouth. Do we win all these games? Do we end up trying to grind on the top of the table and chasing Rotherham and the rest of them? You'll have to find out. Let's hit to the intro. Yo, so in this episode guys, we're going to be playing three games, so we're going to be playing at Bradford first, then we are going to be playing Hull at home, Greenside Lane, and then we have a nice trip to Fratton Park to play Portsmouth, and Portsmouth are currently second in the series, as you've seen from the last episode. Please remember to like the videos guys, and subscribe to the channel if you have not already. So, let's crack on. And I'll show you the team. So the team for this one is I threw Baker in because if you remember in the last episode that uh, Cortez ended up getting sent up for a second yellow, very clumsy tackle. Um, also, uh, prior turns Foxy and Forget are now back in the lineup just to get them refreshed and everything. They needed a game off, so hopefully we end up beating these. So. Yeah, we're off. Look at their front two. They've got two cooks. Two cooks don't spoil the broth, if that's what the saying is. But yeah, let's rock on and let's beat these. Come on, boys! Here we go. Bradford City. We ended up having an entertaining game against these the last time we burst them. Let's see how well they are now. Oh, they've got cook to cook. Come on, boys. Don't let me down this episode. Well, I carry it with a corner. It's the usual stint, always. I do meant to have a shot. Oh, straight into Tommy's hands. Oh, we've lost it. Vigay's done well to get the ball back. Oh, it's too much. Can you square it back? It's 1 0. You know who? Jacob Bartlett, straight to the corner. It was a bit weird because I don't think I wanted to get the ball to Bandora there, but nice square pass to the ball to just tap it straight past the keeper. A bit of trickery there. Well done. 1 0, boys. Let's keep going. Oh. Oh, I don't know what he's doing there. He's going to put it into his own net. Win it, Foxy. Oh, forget. Try to be a bit um, fancy there. Let's play it simple. Oh, it's cut. No, that's not a foul. He tripped. Get up. Here we go. Eddie turns. What are you doing there, lad? Going to go for a jog. Go on, then. Hard lines. What, you... Made a balls up in defence now. You've done well to get it to get back there. Prior to um Valakari. Okay. Bartlett. Oh Valakari's there. Is it gonna be number two? That was very poor. Ah, it shows that. Well done, lad. No, no, oh no. Get it gone, get it gone. Come on, get it gone, get it gone, get it gone. Don't let them score. Get it gone! Oh. oh. Oh, he beat Hurst. Cooks away. Oh, clear it. Oh, oh, don't believe that. 
Oh, Stacy, 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 what on earth are you doing? It's embarrassing when their right back scores an acrobatic kick. That is ridiculous. Come on, boys, don't let him through. Great tackle. Right, get going. Make the runs. Right, go on, Valkyrie. This time. Valkyrie. Because it's Jacob Bartlett. Hit out the keeper. Oh, come on, boys. He's tired him. Oh, don't pass it there. Oh, I've got to say. Quit before half time. Here we go. Bartlett's there. He's got the assistance. He's going to go all by himself. Oh, and the keeper's beat him again. Half time, guys. It's 1 1. Uh. Not a bad half, I suppose. They shouldn't have got theirs. Stacey ended up for him messing up. He should have caught it from that aquatic shot. Just don't let these be wide open. No, stop the cross, stop the cross. Well done. I said, stop the cross. It's a no go. Oh god, oh Songo. What kind of name is that? Well blocked. Come on Hurst. Right, quick one two. Someone's there. It's Malakari. Shoot! Oh this keeper's unstoppable. Oh, typical there, goal scorer goals off. No one's there to win it. Right. Oh, come on, Foxy. Turns. And a mentor across. Bartlett's there. 2 2. Praying. Nice play there. And a mentor had to play that long ball across and just hope Bartlett was there. And he was. 2 2. Game on now. Come on, boys. Half an hour to go. We can beat these. Adora. All by himself. Oh. Should have passed. And for the rest of this game against Bradford, I think it was very boring. So I don't want you watching the 50-50 moments because it would be pretty unfair. Anyway, I'm going to bring it to the full-time whistle and roll on to the second game of the episode, which is against Hull. Oh, full-time guys. What a frustrating game. 2-2, two, two, another draw for us. Like I say, we did have, we had the chances, they had chances. It could have gone either way towards the end there. We had the chance, but it was offside. They ended up with one, and it nearly ended up in the back of the net. Up 2-2 two, two against Bradford. Next game, Hull at home. I'll see you there. Second game, so as you can see there, from the table, we have actually dropped to fourth. Peter ended up winning 5-1 in their last game. And by the looks of it, Rotherham won their game. So we're now eight points behind. So we can't keep drawing games. But let's move on to the team. 
So that's it for this one. Cortez is going to come back into the team. I'm actually going to play Bandora on the right and I'm going to let Walker have a bit of a run out this game. Um, I've also ended up putting Waller in for his first game of the season. Just so everyone gets a bit of game time. So I'm, we've also got Merkovic still on the bench. Wright's on the bench. So one of them may get changed out. If Waller does play bad, I will sub him off straight away. And by the looks of it, with all these fixtures, a lot of players are starting to get a bit tired. Because look at the likes of Hull's team there, like Leek, Arthur, Lewis Potter. It's like with us, because we've got Bandora and Hurst who are playing week in, week out. But we need to keep them playing. Right, let's get to the pitch. And let's go. Game number two against Hull City. Alright, come on boys. No more drawing. No more losing. Let's get to the top. Uh, right, come on, Foxer. Pandora. Pandora. Good shot. Good shoot again. Want to use win it? He's done well. Foxer. Spellacari is all the way round. Shoot! It's off the bar. Hard lines there, Balakari. Head up, lad. Oh, don't let him through, don't let him through, don't let him through. Nope. Oh, he's given a penalty. And you booked him for that. Well. Stay set, it's all down to you. Save it. Yes! Well saved. Kept an eye on that ball. Good man. Alright, you're not taking it short. Oh. The way through. Good save again by Stacer. Nah, don't let him play short. Don't let him play it. your hands up. See it's offside. I know it did in the end but ever heard of that rule? Play to the whistle. I'll carry. Oh it's a fantastic play. Walk with a cross. Forget it's there. It's 1-0. They didn't have to defend for that one. There was a bit of a hula dance there Peggy. Good man. Nice run there from Walker. Simple cross. Forget on side. It actually luckily. It was very lucky that went in. Because I think that was just going wide. But 1-0. To so the boys again. Go on, boys. Keep going. Oh, stand here. Great, love you. Oh, we've let them through again. No, well done, Waller. Not fully cleared. Calcutta. <laughs> Walker to Valakari. Foxy is through. He's Got Pandora with him as well. Pandora the Explorer! In off the post. Back in the lead. Who else but Pandora the Explorer? Pandora, Dora, Dora the Explorer. Pandora! Yeah, nice goal that. In up the post. What a better way to score. 2-1, half an hour gone. 
three goals in it. Oh! Go watch them long shots. Nice play there. Bartlett. Kuhn. Well, the carry got on the end of it. He has. He's got it. He's going to go for a shot. It's been saved by Ingram. Bandora with a corner. Walker's there. Just over the bar. And the looks like that is half time, guys. And it is. Two goals to one. Um. <clears throat> Fair half. Okay, the second half begins. So I've just had a quick glance at the results. Um, Portsmouth are currently losing 1 0, and Rotherham are drawing 1 1. So let's just hope that we keep this win and then we can start building up across the table. I didn't see how Peter were done, sadly. But like I say, it was only a quick glance. Could have caught that, Stacey. You need to use your hands more. Oh, whoa! Oh. Don't let him through, don't let him through. Don't let them through. Clear it! Nice, come on. Nice ball there. Stay on side. Pryor's all the way up. Pryor's done well. There's a cross. Sure, so has got a shoot. Oh, let's keep it. Oh, that was very poor. I was hoping it was going to go to Bartlett, not Bandora. Nice one. I'll play that Bartlett. Oh, I give a foul. What? Uh oh. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. Don't let him through, don't let him through. Shows keeper. Well done, Stacey. Oh, couldn't you just play on? Prior. My carry to Walker, this is nice play. One of them in the box, oh, it's too far. Cortez has caught it though. Cortez with a cross. Still going nowhere. Well, carry with the header. No. No, don't let him through. No. Oh. Good save again, Stacey. Oh, I'm hoping Hurst to come off. Corner, clear it. Leave it, that's fine. Forget. Oh, Bartlett shoots, it's in, it's goal number three. That man Bartlett, King of Stan United, King of Standing United, my way there. Huh? Three one, nice play there. Quick one touch passing, and Bartlett just turns the defender inside out, taps it straight past the keeper. Beautiful goal. 3 1. Okay, here we go. Go on, have another. Oh, we're through again. Strip on the kickoff. It's Bartlett again! There's not much to say. Straight from the kickoff, Bartlett 
Bala ended up scoring literally three minutes before and he's got himself, bagged himself another. That's very poor keeping that. If I was their manager, I'd be absolutely fuming. If the ball went straight down the middle and you didn't get it. Bartlett. Oh, keeper fumbled it. Could have caught it. I'll bring Yang Kai on for prior as well for the last five. There's the corner. Kinsella. Oh, it was a very bad passer. Oh, I'm in trouble now. It's all Hull. Everyone's back. Oh, and he could have squared it. He went greedy. I don't think he's going to keep that one in. Oh, he has. He's done well. Can Sailor. Bartlett again. He's got five minutes. Okay, now. Oh, Hurst has let him through. Save again by Stacer. Let's see if we can get another goal out of there. So it's full time. We beat Hull at Greaseside Lane by four goals to one. I think we just turned on the second half. We ended up playing very well. Like I say, they had certain chances. Bartlett, who ended up getting two in quick succession. With a matter of goals, in, yeah, he got two goals within three minutes. Can't really moan. We've got one more to go, and also goals from Bandora and Fagir. <laughs> and we roll on to our final game, which is at Fratton Park against Portsmouth. So, back in the office, guys, I've just got a call from my youth academy, and look at this guy. Overall, 58 to 78. Wow. He could play in any of those positions. He's definitely getting signed up. Already, he's worth 1.5 million. And this guy, yeah, I'll adjust the thing. Well, that is crazy. So, well, what is ranked? Sixty-five rated at the age of fifteen. He's a right midfielder. Like I said, I can't promote him yet because he's only fifteen. Once he's sixteen, then I can. Um, make him into an invert midfielder so we can get the training on him. So the team for this one is I know these are currently in second, but I've had to make some changes because everyone. He's now, as you've probably seen, they are now getting absolute shattered. So I made a couple of changes. I put Willis in that. Taylor turns right and Gibbs. And I'm going to come back in. So with Williams, I'm going to play Noble this game as well. And uh, Badora, <clears throat> as you know, is always going to be playing. And I've put Hollander with Battler at the front. Let's beat these and then hopefully we could crawl up to second. Sadly, Rotherham won their game, so they end up winning 4 1. Just hope they don't win this one. Right, let's get to the pitch. Come on, boys. Right, yo, here we go. Fratton Park against Portsmouth, who are currently in second position. These are our chasers at the moment, who we need to mainly catch up. No more slip ups. Come on, boys. Williams done well. Back to court. Uh, oh, it's Taylor. Caught to them. Used to saying his name. 
I just get the ball away. Well done. Thanks. Oh, he's through. Oh, I can't catch him. My looks of it. Oh, it's on the bar and it's gone in on the rebound. Uh, what a poor start. I've totally given the ball away. Just swung it straight to the right side. Up the bar, but Eddie Turns couldn't do anything about the header. Well, it's like the chasers are going to get us by the looks of it. Oh, right, come on. Oh, that's a very bad ball. Come on, boys. Wake up. Noble. Noble by himself. Got one back. It's Noble who's not played many games this season. <clears throat> Thought he'd go for a jog and end up scoring. You don't buy the ticket, you don't win the raffle. Nice pass there from Bandora. Like he had Bartlett on the left and he had Hollander on the right. He even had a Dementia further behind, but Noble just went all by himself. Come on, boys, come on. Oh! Can't keep letting these through. Straight to Adi Mensa. It was too much of a heavy pass from Cortez. Uh, oh, Taylor there. I need to see Cortez. It's too many, did Don't let him throw. Great save there by Willis. Oh. Oh, the scored, but it's offside. Ha 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 ha. Williams. Referee, yellow card. Thank you. Bartlett. Oh no, it's yours, Gibbs. It's fine. It's all yours. Can you see Bandora down the line? Yes, you can. Nice touch there to Noble. Referee. No, it was a shoulder badge, but fucking arm was a bit hard, wasn't it? Oh, come on. I'll do. Keep it in, well done. A Dementia. Done well. Stick with it. Oh, it's Hollander! It's two for Standard United. Philip Hollander is on the score sheet. And Standard United lead at Fratton Park. Nice play there by Eddie Mensah. And then just a simple first time shot by Hollander. He had a quick glance, he knew where he was putting it. 2-1 to the standard. Hooray. Right, just keep the lead, just don't concede anymore. No, no. No, don't let him through. Why is Taylor so far central? 
He needs to be further out on the right. Oh, don't let him round. God, flipping all when you played, eh? Nah. Good save. Clear it. Flipping out. Give over. You played over three minutes of time there. You cheats. They do not deserve that goal. You played five minutes of injury time. You requested for two. Good save by Willis, but come on. What a joke. You'll blow the whistle now as soon as I kick it. Yeah, I knew you would, you cheating git. Half time, guys. 2-2. Two -two. They played five minutes. When I get the ball in my possession, or whatever, we get, ed they end up, no, sorry, the referee always blows. Every time it's the opposition, oh, it's all right, yeah, but I'll let you play on. It's fine, it's still in your flipping area. Yeah, flipping cheats. Get him off. All right, this is going in. Bang. Come on, boys. Going to one of them. All, all defended. We've been getting a hat trick against us. Oh, fuck's sake. My que my queers. That's what you fucking are. We shouldn't be losing this game. The flipping sheets. No! Oh my god! Fucking hell, boys! Wake up! See, two goals within three minutes! Beyond a joke! Gotta get back in this now! We need all the support we need! Come on, Bartlett, do something. Oh, just our defence is bobbins. Look, straight through again. Great tackle. Oh, have a look where you're playing it. Offside. Win the header. Oh, it's going straight to them. Again. Five. Him again. He's got four against us. Win it. Oh, Kari. Come on, lad. This time. Oh, you missed. And there's the full time whistle. What 
a horrible game, you cheating little shit. John Marcus, you flipping cheat. And it, the officials may have wore Portsmouth shirts as well, because that goal they got for their second shouldn't have counted. It was well over time. I'm just really pissed off with that game. I know we played poor, but you don't need officials to be on your side to win. That is an absolute disgrace. You play in any game. I know you may end up saying, oh, you play till the whistle. Right, I understand that. But you played over nearly three minutes of normal time because they had the possession it was in there it was they was on the attack and the way it was in the box and everything like that but you do not end up playing on that is an utter disgrace so let's just have a quick look at the table before we finish the episode so due to that defeat with Portsmouth they had clearly four points Behind Rotherham, we have dropped some vital points. That would have, if we would have won that game, we would have pipped second, maybe third. But it's not good. When you have officials on your side, it's an absolute disgrace. But as you can see there, fourth spot, we got. Teams chasing us, we got Wigan, Ipswich, Bristol Rovers and Hull chasing us at this moment. It's not what we really want. We don't want people, we don't want teams chasing us at this moment. Because we want to get all the tough games out of the way first. And we have, like Rotherham's and Portsmouth have you seen, well in this episode, in the last episode, we drew with Rotherham. And with Portsmouth, as you know, like I say, you don't need cheats on your team. That's just an absolute disgrace. Fuming, guys. In the next episode, we are going to be playing the FA Cup against Bristol Rovers. Then back in the league against Lincoln. And then we have got to verse Port Vale in at Papa John's Trophy. But if you look further down, you'll all be excited for the episode after because we are going to be versing Man United out of all the teams to pick from in the Carabao Cup that were left. We ended up with them. That's the end of this episode, guys. Remember... Like the video, comment down below if you enjoyed the series, and also subscribe to the channel if you have not. Cheers, guys. I'll see you in the next episode. That is going to be the end of this video, guys. So don't forget to hit a thumbs up, comment down below, and also subscribe to the channel if you've not already. If you want to, this corner is the place to go. If you want to watch any of my vlogs, this corner here. If you want to watch any of my Standing United series, just here. And if you want to watch any more of the Dark Cloud series, then go into this corner, like so. Remember guys, stay safe and stay standard.